What's up guys, it's Corey and you're back watching the Cloud Corner. Uh, today we're going to talk about some hardware. Uh, I know you love the hardware reviews, but we are uh, talking about Axis Vapes today. Now, um, I changed up a few things, uh, mainly being one, my intro. Uh, I wanted something cleaner and uh, shorter and not so crazy because you all don't want to watch that uh, intro all the time. But uh, I also got a clamp for one of my webcams, so now I can get a better up close view, which we are going to be up close and personal with this guy, which is the M17 mod from Axis Vapes. But first, let's welcome you back to the cloud. So what'd you think of the new uh, intro? Let me know in the comments. I do want to know. Um, so like you saw, we are talking about Axis Vapes new M17 mod. Now, originally these were a small batch mod. Uh, they would make a couple of them, put them out, and they would within the first couple of batches they sold out within minutes. Uh, I was one of the first uh, to order uh, an Axis uh, M17 mod. However, I did. I was in such a rush because the website was, you know, crashing consistently. That, which is amazing for them, but uh, for me, I didn't get the exact mod I wanted. I got one made of acrylic when I wanted one made of stabilized wood. So uh, I had messaged Win uh, Warren, one of the um, creators of the Axis Vapes company, and uh, commissioned a stabilized wood mod for myself. Now. Uh, it came out absolutely gorgeous, and we're going to take a close-up look at it in a, in a, in a couple minutes, but um, let's talk a little bit more about the Axis M17 mod. So the Axis M17 mod is made in a custom enclosure. Um, it has helicoil thread inserts to keep it in place. It does have a nice LiPo battery in it. It's a 12.21 watt hour uh, lipo battery which is equivalent to 1100 milliamp hours um, which like for me lasts me a couple of days um, but for someone who's you know the average vapor or vaping maybe a little more than average you'll probably end up charging it at night or um, you know depending on how much you vape maybe sometime during the day now you have a uh, mytech switch on here a varitube 510 but we'll take a closer look at that when we go um, in uh, up close mode <laughs> now uh, cool thing I'll show you when we go up close is that they serialize them and they're en engraved and the cool vent holes there now I want to talk to you a little bit about um, Axis Vape as a company Axis Vapes as a company okay so Win Warren um, is the creator of Axis Vapes and uh, I've had the pleasure of talking with him for some time and uh, I kind of actually got which is really cool to watch the business grow and um, the way I got to do that is the first, you know, I was talking to him before, the day before his first batch of mods uh, came out, and uh, I was like, dude, I'm so excited, you know, I'm excited for you, I know this is going to do well, and it gets to the day, and we get to the release, you know, it, they get to the release, and I'm waiting to buy one, and the website crashes, so, you know, I, I messaged him, like, oh my god, dude, what happened? He's like, so many people are looking at the website that it completely crashed. So I was like, dude, this is the best news ever. However, I still want to buy my freaking mod. <laughs> so, you know, I, he was just like, keep refreshing, keep refreshing. And he's updating the Facebook page as all this is going on. So everyone can see, you know, you know, the website's not down. It's just really packed right now. And, and keep trying. So I was able to get through and get one. And uh, I, I just wanted one. I didn't care what it was. So I ended up getting an acrylic one. And, um, you know, it... it it really it was so beautiful but I really originally had the intention of getting a stabilized wood one so I had messaged him and I was like hey you know is there any way I can commission a mod from you you know you know buy one in, in a color scheme that you know I might like he's like yeah no problem you know we'll, we'll, we'll you know we'll help you out and um, he was so patient and, and you know not a lot of places put that much effort into customer service and you know, a lot of a lot of places do, but there are some that you know aren't really great. But I, I win went above and beyond for me, and it's much appreciated. So as he kept dropping batches, I would you know because I, I wanted him to do well, uh, I would keep watching the website, and he would sell out in five minutes. 
So the first batch went, the second batch went, the third batch went in five minutes. And then, you know, he got to the point where he was able to do his production release, which was a couple of weeks ago. And um, now what I mean by production release is he's consistently releasing mods to the public every single day. Now, um, he doesn't tell anyone what time, so he says you got to check the website between the day. And if you get lucky, you'll end up getting one. Now, um, it's cool because if you don't get it one day, you have the next day to get it. It's not like once every month or once every, you know, every couple of weeks. Um, but, but these things are really beautiful. And, and there's a lot of work that goes into them. They're point to point wired, um, hand wired rather. And overall, the mod is just really great. So we're going to take a second, um, go up close with it. And then we'll talk about pricing and kind of what you're looking at. All right, so this is the M17 mod by Axis Vapes. As you can see, it's in a little bit of a C shape on the wood. Um, it is a DNA 200 device. I will get this to focus for us so we can see the screen. All right, I can send that baby all the way up to uh, 200 watts, which is awesome. So you have the newest evolved chipset in there. If you look at the work on the actual mod itself, it is probably some of the cleanest work I've ever seen. Um, they put a lot of time into this, and it's much appreciated, I'm sure, by all the customers. But this thing is quite beautiful. The colors alone I, I absolutely love, love. But this is one of the, the cooler mods. So as you can see, we have the 510 up here. You know, nice um, flat uh, 510. Um, and we have a MyTech switch for the button. You have your Bob DNA 200 screen. You got the clicky clicky buttons, which you love, and the micro USB port, as well as the two, looks like uh, hex screws to actually keep the enclosure in. Um, other than that, on the bottom of every mod, they engrave. Um, their logo as well as your serial number so no fudge in the serial number as well as having these uh, nine holes to help vent the, the mod properly um, this mod is really really cool uh, the specs inside are even more cool <laughs> and uh, for me this thing will last me probably around four or five days on one charge because I don't vape as much as I used to however I do use this consistently and uh, I thoroughly enjoy it so um, we'll head back out and uh, get our final thoughts on the Axis M17 mod all right so now that you've seen the mod up close uh, we can kind of talk about how much they would cost you so there's actually um, a price range in between 350 and and four hundred dollars now compared to other high-end mods that are on the market it is relatively low now um, yeah you want to put your vape budget hands on it as uh, <laughs> Grim Green would say but overall considering you know I've seen a lot of stabilized wood mods that go for way more that don't look as beautiful as these do I'd say it, it's a steal so um, for 350 you get the acrylic which uh, is the chakras is what it was what the category is on the website I will put a link in the description so you can go check them out now it's also got a little um, button now that when you go to the the shop you can see all the previously sold mods and it's kind of cool because it shows you where they went it shows you um, when they were made and it shows you pictures of them so you can actually see the color schemes and some of these are absolutely gorgeous and I'm super jealous of the people that actually have them but um, there is uh, the chakras, there is the single die stab wood, and there's the double die. Um, so the double die is $400. The single uh, the single die, I believe, is $375. I may be wrong on that one. I just have to double check. And the $350 for the acrylic. Um, they do drop every day. Like I said, uh, the production release, they are coming out every single day. And I would uh, advise you all to check out the website at least once and, and take a look at them. If you don't want to buy them, just look at them because they are absolutely like works of art. Now I'm waiting for my uh, Pico RTA to show up so I can throw it on top of this and um, have a beautiful setup that I can take with me all the time because I'm not since I've been on zero since September I haven't really vaped as much as I used to. Um, 
you know what? I think it was the fact that I got myself off of needing the dependency of nicotine, but uh, I still get great flavor, and I'm actually able to taste, you know, a, a lot of the flavors a little more. But um, I've been so busy lately that I haven't had a chance to do some reviews, so I apologize to you guys for that. But um, now that I got a new little setup with a little some cool stuff, uh, you're gonna be seeing a bunch more reviews. But right now, you know. I'm more a little more focused on my my health and my weight loss um, so I will you know be doing reviews as as much as I can for you and uh, I am going to vapor slam in a couple of weeks now so two weeks a little more than two weeks and um, I will be doing a video like I did for vape mania and uh, it's gonna be a blast so um, I look forward to, to giving that to you guys and um, if you have any questions, comments, please comment below. I'm more than happy to answer them. I, I try to answer every single one. Um, I usually do. And uh, other than that, you know, we'll see you next time with a, another review. But uh, I thank you guys for watching, and um, I appreciate it. So we'll, we'll see you next time on the Cloud Corner.